Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So this is a B&M and a home bargain haul. I'm doing it all in one because it's just quite itty bitty doing two separate videos and makes it a bigger haul. So wasn't overly successful. I did pick up a few bits and pieces. Obviously you guys know if you followed me for a while, I pick up bits from my friends at work, family, you know, etc. as well. Um, so we went to one about an hour away, a B&M, which is like the best one in sort of the southwest, really. Um, picked up a bit, didn't get a lot of presents. I was going really for Christmas presents, but didn't really get a lot in that respect. But I picked up bits and bobs that I needed and friends needed and stuff anyway. So that was really good. And then we popped into our local home bargains on the way back. So that was good. So... Picked up a few decorations. So one of my colleagues at work, one of my friends, she has two Christmas trees and one of her Christmas trees has bronze and orangey baubles on. So I said to her, I'm sure I've seen them in B&M. She said, oh, could you get me some different ones? So I got her these beautiful, they're stunning. They're oh, orange, bronze. You've got matte, glittery, shiny ones there. And then I picked up a pack of the 40 different coloured autumnal looking ones for three pounds the mini baubles really really nice love the colors so i got her those um i'll just move that a minute then i picked up these i need some smaller bits for my tree oh by the way thank you so much for the lovely comments on my video of doing my tree um it's not 100 percent finished i do need a few little bits like this so I saw these and they've got like sort of marble effect on these little teardrop things. So I got them for two pounds and then I saw these and I thought these were so pretty. Again, some of these have the marble effect on these little hearts from B&M 250. So I got those two rolls of brown parcel paper. If you haven't already, check out my eBay page. If you guys like handbags and things like that, do check it out. I do sell quite a lot of Kipling. If you guys know what Kipling is, it's a good brand of bag. So yeah, I sell a lot on there. So I always need brown paper. So I got that. Then I picked up these for my friend. as a little Christmas present, just a little token present. These little lip balms. She loves lip balms. Two ninety nine from B and M. The Starburst lip smackers. Um, then I saw these decorations. I think these are beautiful. They're stunning. They're like these lovely little frosted oh no they're not frosted what i'm talking about they're like fluffy little reefs they are two pound fifty each they were quite i think it's quite expensive really for that but when they will go on my tree i think they'll look quite expensive so i picked up four of those i'll just pop them there ignore the plate sorry um then i picked up some brown paper i can never have enough i always get it when i go two rolls for a pound then just my staple buy packs of razors then i got my dad this he likes brew. Oh, I can't stand it personally, but he likes it. So I picked up that as a little present for him. I'll get him something else, but I saw that in there. So you get a deodorant and the shower gel. So I got him that. Then my colleague at work wanted some of the Lion Bars, the Caramel Blonde ones. So I got her those from B&M. Like I say, this part of this haul is B&M minus that there, but I'll tell you that in a minute. Some little Chubba Chubs lollipops, they were a pound again at B&M. Some Mentos, the mint ones, the chewy ones, they're just nice to have. Put them in my bag. Um, oh, there's those orangey baubles, I'll put them there. Then I just picked up a bag of these Sour Cream and Chive pet pretzels and some boxes of Poppets, two orange and a toffee. Quickly from Home Bargains, I've just put these randomly here. Two of the Latte Macchiato Vanillas. The cold coffees are really, really nice. And I always get this mouthwash from Home Bargains. It's like 79p. So I picked up another one of those. Back to B&M. I saw these um, little, they're in little tubes. They're cranberry and turkey licks. They're for cats. Um... My friend who I used to live with before I lived here, she's got a little kitty, so she likes these licky tube things. So I thought I'd give my friend those for her. That'd be a bit funny. Then I picked up this is um I'm not sure. Oh my god. I'm not sure what the dupe is of this, but it smells incredible and it's $2.99 from Home Bargains. No, B and M. <laughs> really, really nice. Sorry, it's been a long day, but um, yeah, really, really nice. Smells incredible for $2.99. Good little stocking filler. 
some Red Leicester mini cheddars, B&M, and some sellotape for, for a pound, so I got that. Um, then my other friend's got two little chihuahuas. I think they're chihuahuas. I'm not really sure what they are, but um, cute two little dogs. So she wanted these friends pet bowls. These are £2.50 now. And it says, could I get any cuter? How sweet is that? And then this one here just says Central Park on, and it's got um, the logo. So two of them, they were half price. So they were two fifty each. Then I got this dinner set for my best friend. She wants this, so she knows about it. Um, from B&M. And it was £20. It's really, really nice. Really nice. So I got her that. You get four dinner plates, four side plates and four bowls for 20 quid. Then I saw this in Home Bargains. Again, it's another dupe of the Packer Band 1 million. You guys know I love it. I buy dupes of it all the time. 99p. So I got that. Home Bargains. Now, like I say, most of this is Home Bargains bar two items, which I'll tell you about. These have just come out. These are the Bliss Bars in the white chocolate and cherry Bakewell flavour. I'm hoping these are going to be nice because everybody's raving about these. They are quite expensive, 150 Normally pay a pound for like the whip bars. But um, yeah, I've wanted to try them, so I've got those. These were a good buy. So I picked up four lots of these. So they're tied together to um, brightening sheet masks. So uh, one's brightening, sorry, and one's nourishing. 49 or 59p so I thought oh I'm gonna put these in my mum's stocking I'm gonna give a pack to my niece so yeah I picked up four lots of them like so you get two for that price with a little ribbon on I thought that was quite sweet staple buy always get these thick and creamy yogurts from home bargains 29p got some of those two things of Sephora from my best one of my best friends who has her salon um she uses this for cleaning down and disinfecting and stuff so I got her she wanted festive one so i got the cranberry and orange and i got the pine needle the fir needle and amber they smell incredible 199 so i've got those for, her for the salon staple buy two things of paracetamol my best friend who i go shopping with my best friend buddy we shop together we love it she is a bargain hunter as well and she managed to get me these ray done um, candles from TK Maxx. I went into our store on Sunday and there was nothing and she went in on Monday. They obviously had a delivery and she found this candle, 9 99 and it says Be Jolly with the Santa and then she got me this one here as well that says Believe. I love them. They're simple, really simple but they're stunning and they smell amazing. I think they're toasted marshmallow flavour, uh, scent rather. So she got me those. They are expensive. They're £10 each but Radon is expensive. There'll be a lot more than that if you've got it from her shop in America. So, yeah, if you guys haven't heard of Radon, she's an American designer. She's amazing. Very simple, her things, but really, really, really nice. And I love her candles. So she got me those. Then I picked up two cans of Dr. Pepper. And then I picked up this. I've raved about this before. This is the Blast Can Air Freshener. This one smells like Dior Sauvage. Amazing. Then I saw these cute little glitter reindeers, one twenty nine for four. So yeah, I thought they'd look nice on the tree. Then me and my friend saw this, she picked up one as well. And this is the Wickford & Co. You get a small jar and three sampler candles for two ninety nine. So I don't know who I'm giving that to, but I've just picked up as a little present, um, just in case, not that I've forgotten somebody, but just in case there's somebody's house I'm going to or something, give them a little present. So I got them that. Been looking for more of these, you guys know. I love these decorations. I've had a lot of compliments on these as well from friends that have been to my house. Um, my Christmas tree, it's these really pretty gemstone reef decorations. They're 149 from Home Bargains, that's the label. And I picked up everything they had left because my mum likes these as well. So um, I just picked them all up and then what I don't need, I think I picked up six. What I don't need, my mum will have, because I'm going to re buy decorations for my mum's tree, because they're not overly great, her decorations, and yeah, I like to do it. So yeah, I got those. Skinny Whips, the strawberry ones, 99p, got some of those. And then I saw these um, Beanie's Coffees, so I picked up the Toasted Marshmallow one um, to try, I'm not sure what it's going to be like. Um, then I just picked up a milkshake, again, another mouthwash. 
Then I picked up these are amazing. They're Sheldon's, um, the Bakers, and these are Lancashire oven bottom muffins. I bought some the other day. My friend at work wanted to try some, so I got her a pack for 89p. I've seen these in the co-op for like nearly two pounds. So yeah, do check out the breads and stuff in Home Bargains because um, they are a lot cheaper. So I've got those. And then my best, one of my other best friends, her little girl, um, picked up these. She is a baby, so she's probably a little bit too young for these at the moment, but she loves it uh, in the night garden. So I picked up these anyway, 129 from Home Bargains, little wooden jigsaw puzzles. So I got those as well. So yes, this is my haul. I'm absolutely exhausted. Been to work, got work tomorrow. But yeah, well worth it. Like I say, I didn't pick up a lot in the way of presents, but um, Black Friday is tomorrow. Hopefully I'll get this out tonight. But um, yeah, so hopefully I'll get some other deals online. So thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, please follow me on my Instagram. I'll put it below. And until next time, I'll see you soon. Take care.